Hello everybody and welcome back to Analog Vernacular. Today we're going to be playing some more Persona 5 Royal. So, we're going to get to go into the dungeon real soon here. But first, I think what we wanted to do was uh, go and talk to Takemi and get her rank up one last time. So we should still have a death. Yep, Mandrake's there. Ready to go. And this is going to get us the uh, the skill or the ability that gives us discounts at her store. The medicine is nearly complete, and there's something I really want to test out. Could you come to the clinic, my little guinea pig? You bet. Let's go. That would really help me out. I reached a milestone, thank thanks to you. Okay, I'll be waiting at the clinic. Alright, we're coming, girl. I suppose. Alright, that's it for today. Oh, are you going home already? If you have some time, why don't you stay and enjoy an apple? I'm sorry, what? It's a gift from one of my elderly patients. She gave me a lot. Well, that's nice. Hello, Dr. Takemi. Chief Oyamata. There was a medical conference nearby, so I thought I'd check up on you. Oh, did you now? Who's this? He doesn't look like a patient. Oh. He's a part-time staffer. I'm having him handle some miscellaneous tasks for me. So, do you have some business with me? I hear you stole one of my patients. A girl with bronchitis? She came here with her father? <sighs> bronchitis, you say? Well, I had no intention of taking her from you. I certainly didn't encourage her to visit my clinic. Now there's talk that the care at a university hospital is inferior to that of a general practitioner. Original medicine. Ha! <laughs> what you're doing here is simply absurd. You're right. I would have turned a blind eye if you had just rotted away out here in this little town. But this is your final warning. Shut this place down and resign your medical license. Whoa, buddy. Um, she's a great doctor, dude. So you need to, uh, step off. What did you say? <laughs> Don't worry about it. Hmm, you seem to be quite fond of her. Perhaps I should reveal this woman's true identity? What? You mean the one I've already heard about the plague? She's a monster who tortured a patient with her unregulated medicine. Terrible, isn't it? She was such a brave girl. Always smiling. This guy's mean. What does this mean? Was? She passed away. What? What? Perhaps you'll suffer the same fate, hmm? <laughs> she is the plague after all. <sighs> Don't lie to me. She should still have some time. She was slowly recovering. Her condition couldn't have deteriorated that quickly. But it did. You must have misjudged. Now, back to the reason why I'm here. Don't ever take another patient away from me again. You don't want to make me angry. Oh man, she's taking this really hard. Iwachan's dead? No. But she's all I've been working toward all this time. Curing her was my only... There's no way. Let's ask for the details. <laughs> what have I been doing all this time? What was even the point? I can't... Just rest for today. Just relax. Yeah, you're, you're right. Sorry. I feel better now. Thanks for your help, my little guinea pig. It feels like my bond with Takemi is growing even deeper. And we got the discount. Decreases the price for all items sold at the clinic. All right. I don't know what to say. I wish I hadn't shown you that side of me. I'm glad you did. <laughs> you are? Well, I suppose that's fine. As long as it's you. Yeah, I guess we have gotten pretty close, haven't we? Go on home for today. 
we will continue this another time. I feel like cooperating in that shady clinical trial has increased my guts. That's the one we have at rank three already, right? Yep. Take care. Ah, you're back. Sure am. Hey. I wonder if that Yoshida guy is giving a speech in Shibuya again today. Yeah, you know what? You're right. I should probably go and talk to him, huh? What is today? Tuesday the 25th? Alright, tomorrow's the lottery day. Now listen up. Hold on. Can I go to Shibuya yet? Yes, okay. Alright, but first, um, let's go to the clinic. I want to see how much this costs now. Please head to the exam room. Okay, so the accessories. This is where it's at right here. SP Adhesive 3. To suffer any An adhesive injuries. that restores much spirit. I want the data I collect from you to be of use. We have 82,000 yen. It's exceptionally effective. Here you go. We're buying an S1. We're buying at least one of them, so. Take care. Hell yeah. So it was 100,000 before, I think. So I'll give you this adhesive. I think it's a uh, seven SP every single turn that you get back. Is it seven? I think it's seven. Um, you've got the Crystal of Lust, which is the Diorama. Breath Ring. A life bonus. Let's give you the Revenge Beer. You've got the Fray. Second mate badge. What does that do again? Just life bonus. Yeah, same thing as the breath. Okay. Alright, well there, we got that. So now let's uh, go and start Yoshida's. Street Orator. That's him right there. So we technically haven't even started his yet. His or EYs. EYs were... Uh, you know what, do we have the guts for EY now? What was it that we needed? Is it three or four? Staunch guts. That might be enough to start EYs. But we're gonna start with uh, Yoshida first. Please consider what I have to say. There have been far too many incidents recently to ignore. Can anyone deny this? Yeah, we've already heard him say this several times. Hey, about Yoshida's speech skills. We should make use of them when you negotiate with shadows. Yeah, that's a good idea. Right? You should ask him. Hmm? Teach you how to give speeches? Why? I want to do what you do. Hmm. I'd love to help you, though... How shall I teach you? It's time for my speech. Let's talk about this later. And while our society appears to be prosperous, many of our young people are quietly suffering. They lack jobs, security, savings. The next generation will lead us into the future, and yet they have no plan for how to arrive there. Watch where you're going, you little shit. You bumped into me, you old goat. Battle of Generations. Good. A tale as old as time. Let's mediate. Yes, let's. Use those uh, speech skills. Good citizens, please stop fighting. <laughs> what is the point of bickering over such a trivial matter? This is none of your business. Yes, yeah, seriously, just shut up. Oh, coming from both. That's not good. What's with this guy? Now they're both against us. It worked. Now if you'll please excuse me, I <laughs> must return to my speech. Together. We can create a bright future for the next generation. Enemy of my enemy is my friend. God, so righteous. That really annoys me. Enough of your arrogance, no good, Tora. What? No, oh, that As reaction. Because if anyone would actually vote for you, are you planning to embezzle funds again, or maybe criticize one of your constituents again? Oh you man. You criminal. Who did we? No, uh... That that was. 
all in the past. Who are you, man? Oh, what have we gotten I've ourselves into? I've done it again. Aren't you gonna get mad? I can't do that in my situation. Regardless, whatever someone calls me no good Torah, I panic. You're gonna have to explain that one, buddy. I went through quite an ordeal 20 years ago. Let me explain. I used to be a member of the National Diet. I was elected during the rise of the Kuramoto children. We were backed by powerful Diet members. This was about 20 years ago. I was very inexperienced back then, both as a politician as well as a human being. That inexperience led me to be involved in a series of major political scandals. Yeah, that doesn't sound good. People refer to my blunders as no good Torah's three strikes. The first was being caught missing a legislative meeting to take a personal vacation. Then, I was accused of embezzling a large sum of money from the party, giving me two strikes. Accused. Did you do it? I mean, I know the answer to that, but, you know, I'm posing questions for the viewers. Finally, I called a voter an idiot at an open forum, which resulted in scandal and strike three. I was out and branded a washed up politician. You said you wanted to become a member of the diet, but do you see the man before you? A questionable background, accused of embezzlement. However, he has conviction and wants to change the world. Public speaking skills could be useful to the Phantom Thief, so I'll make a deal with him. Do you really want to receive my guidance? I suppose I do. You seem to have conviction. To go through all that and still I'm want to try to, to make it better? However, everyone says I have no chance to get elected. So why come to me? Have confidence in yourself, Yoshida. <laughs> You're doing a good job of cheering me up. <laughs> but you may be right. The most important part about giving a good speech is believing in yourself. Perhaps one day... I will believe in myself again. But you sure got me there. You're a strange young man. Very well. If learning how to give a great speech is what you seek, then I'd be happy to instruct you. In exchange, I would like for you to continue assisting me. Let's get started, shall we? All right, I'm in. I've made a deal with Yoshida. Make your bets on his arcana. Staging your crimes with calling cards. It's hard to believe that a student could manage this alone. An adult. For example, someone talented enough to move people with words. Perhaps they coached you. Isn't that right? I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new vow. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the sun persona, I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. Okay, the arcana is the sun. So, confidant, man of the people, represented by the sun arcana. So this is often a card of good fortune. Uh, the universe has come together and agrees with you and your choices and will aid you forward. It is tied with ideas of joy, enlightenment, material happiness, success, and vitality. Um, that's all of the uh, upright. But on the reverse of the card, it could indicate a false impression, lack of clarity, low vitality, and even sadness. But right. overall, it seems to be a pretty, pretty positive looking card. Let's pursue your dream of becoming a member of the Diet. Oh my, we've been talking for far too long. Let's call it quits. He is a very positive guy. Despite... 
despite his you. situation. I'm sorry, there's something I forgot to mention. It's about my speech schedules from this point on. Would you be willing to stick around to hear it? Let me write this down. <laughs> Quite a practical young man, eh? Well, I won't take up too much of your time. I'll be here giving my speeches every Sunday. You're welcome to drop by and help whenever you've got the time. Well then, I shall see you again soon. That's all I wanted to say. Now be careful on your way home. His, um, his confidant is a little bit different. Basically, he sends you messages when he's going to have a speech, and then you decide whether to go to them or not to we rank meet up. Again. In other words, you don't actually need to uh, worry much about having a persona for him, um, because he basically you're always going to rank up when he sends you a message. You don't. The affinity does not factor into it. At least it didn't in the original. We'll see if that changes at all here, but I'm assuming that he will function the exact same. It appears you're lying low lately. What's with the change? Maybe uh, someone's been on my tail. Huh? Maybe? What do you mean? Let's play coy. Don't worry about it. It must have been my imagination. I'm sure. Anyway, I wish the culprit would come forward soon. It's absurd to pretend I can do the police's job. I wish he considered my feelings before asking me this. Hmm. I think I'm starting to realize why I've always liked Makoto so much. She's very similar to Tifa. I'm also playing Final Fantasy VII right now, the remake, and uh, they're both just badasses that love using their fists, and... Uh, have, you know, the red eyes. It's the Maybe it's the red eyes. They both have red eyes. Okay. So, today, we're going to be going in. Looks like Ryuji wants to hang out, and On probably wants to go in. So, let's see. Is there anything else that we need to do out here? I don't think I was going to get any new gear. Um, the SP accessory is the one that I really wanted to get somewhere. before going back in. Um, I think my first playthrough, I didn't actually get that accessory until the third dungeon. So, we've gotten it pretty early here, honestly. So, okay, we've got a save. Oh, you know what we do need to do? We need to go and pick up our... Lottery ticket. 10,000 yen. Let me give that to you right now. Nice. Oh. Welcome. Okay, 6-1. Gotta write that down. Should be the following Wednesday. All right. And that's all we should really need to do today. Aren't we going to the palace? If we are, I'll count on you to gather everyone. What do you want to do? Let's go. Yusuke, we still need to explain the basics to you, don't we? Oh, you mean about the metaverse and the nav? Yeah, I guess that stuff is pretty important. Please elaborate. Okay, let's start from the beginning. First, the metaverse spots where we act as the Phantom Thieves are called palaces. Palaces are worlds that take form from someone's cognition. A materialization of their reality. So do we each hold palaces within ourselves as well? No, not just anyone will have one. It's primarily those with strong, distorted desires. They basically gotta be criminals. Real bastards like Kamoshida or Matarame. On the other hand, palaces can't exist within persona users. It's just impossible for them to form. Basically, your persona is the true feelings of your heart, which arise from accepting your inner shadow. Then, since you have full control over your emotions, there's no way your desires can get distorted. S so that's how it works. Uh, obviously. I, I knew that. Yeah, oh, yeah. he did. And we use the Metaverse Nav app on our phones to get into that world. It's actually...
actually pretty simple. Just say a person's name, location, and distortion, then you're in. Location? Uh, so like, Matarame's would be Shaq. Then his distortion is that he thinks it's a museum. How do you know what their palace is going to look like if you've never set foot in it before? That part's kind of like a quiz or something. It'll probably get pretty tricky from here on out, too. Hmm. Yes, I word. feel as though I have a good grasp on the basic concepts. If anything arises which I fail to understand, I'll rely on those more experienced than myself. Yeah, I got you covered, newbie. Uh, you should probably ask Morgana <laughs> if you need anything. So much shade. Thinking back Poor to Yuji. though, I can't believe you'd consider pressing charges. Yes, I've never seen him show such anger before. He is most likely quite serious about that. What should we do? There's no way we'll be able to win if that happens. He likely won't act on that threat until the final day of the exhibit, June 5th. Simply put, I doubt he would be so foolish as to taint his name with a trial during his exhibition. Alright, so we just gotta steal Madarame's heart by then? There's no way we're gonna let him press charges. We'll show people who he really is. Okay. Let's go in. Okay, let's go. I feel like that was meeting enough. We don't have to hold a meeting. That was our meeting. Let's go. Oh yeah. We haven't decided on the new recruit's code name yet. It has to be Kitsune. You know, with that Kitsune mask and everything. Hell yeah. That really leaves an impression. I actually do like that. Are you talking about me? What do you want your name over here to be? I'd say Da Vinci. Nope. Nope. <laughs> well, you've got that mask like On said, and there's that weird tail. All right, you're Abu Rage. <laughs> Very well. <laughs> He's agreed to it? I don't know what that He's is. decided then. Abu Rage. Nuh uh, not happening. Do you have any ideas, Joker? How about Fox? Oh, just keep it literal, huh? Sounds good to me. What do you think, Fox? It's acceptable. It's set then. Let's go. By the way, we should have Joker decide who our starting lineup is from here on out. Starting lineup? You mean the ones who will be going in first? Yeah. Now that Fox has joined us, it'll be harder to move around as a group. We'll stand out more, too. Considering how we've operated to this point, we should have four starters. Anyone else can be backup. And I guess we always gotta have our leader with us, right? Exactly. That's why we'll have Joker choose the remaining three. And what should the backup do? Would it be best for them to stay outside of the palace? No. They should come in as well, but maintain a reasonable distance from the main group. In other words, the starting lineup is the first wave of our infiltration force. Well, we'll leave the team composition to you, Joker. Party organization. To change party members, speak with your teammates at the palace entrance. You can also press triangle and select stats from the menu. Which is just so nice. Okay. So, who do we want to take in? We'll definitely take him in. May I get a word in? Sorry to cause you trouble. We need at least one healer. Um, how are our levels? I mean, they should be pretty good. Morgana's a little low, so maybe we'll take Morgana and leave On out for a minute. Oh? Did you change your mind? Whoops. Let us be off. Okay, Morgana. What's up? Now's my time to shine! Joker. Yeah. And I also think that I might want to switch. I kind of want you to have the revenge mirror for counters. And I want you, Ske, to have the diorama. And I guess the breath ring and the second mate badge are exactly the same, so that doesn't matter too much. 
Okay, we'll just make sure everything's good there. And there. Cool. Yeah, I should probably fuse. What's my level? 15? Whoa. Do you need something? Got to make room for new persona, you know? You certainly. Justine, you handle okay, this. Okay, we're all registered. The inmate needs you wish to perform an execution. Let us begin the search. Okay, fuse by results. By level. 15 and below. So we can make Looks him a Kami. Tough. Nullifies gun, weak to Zeo. Has a uh, fray. Energy drop, that's a pretty good one. Yeah, energy drop is great. What do you take? Okay, I think we could do that. Select the skills you'd like to inherit. Okay, increases technical damage by 25. Decreases SP cost of ice skills. Probably that one, because we're going to give him some ice. Uh, increase effect period of support skills cast on self by one. That one's also very good. Um, yeah, let's do that one. I'm going to give you Bufu and Mabufu. And probably Rakukaja. Increased defense for three turns. It's power or not in no, not unusual. that one. Yeah, Rakunda. It's power. Decreased defense on the enemy. My, my. And there's our Mikami. Me Mikami. Maybe your mask. Me be your mask and howl at enemies. He's a good boy. Okay, we haven't made a Copa Tengu yet. A regent? And oh, no, I don't want to use Mikami for that. Uh, Inugami. Not terrible, but not impressive. I don't want to use the one that I just made. Regent and Mandrake would make a McCoy. Mm. Okay. And we don't have some of the other features in uh, in the Velvet Room that I could make use of right now with the Regent, so uh, we'll see if we can hold on to the Regent for a little bit longer. But we may have to drop the Mandrake uh, if we capture too many Personas. But um, We have basically three slots, because the Mandrake I'll just drop. Um, if I have to. Done already. Done already. What? No slacking off. I think uh, our next request for the attendance is Ameno Uzume, right? So we're gonna have to keep an eye out for that. Okay, so we got Zio and Agi here. We've got Bufu and Aya, Frey. Aya, Frey, Bufu, um, we don't really have a Garu, because you can't actually battle with these guys, so, um, so it's a good thing we have Morgana with us then, alright, now we did find one of those skulls that right. give you extra SP, now, so, uh, when we here? start getting low, I'm gonna have to go and grab those. I'll just add this. But for now, we get to move on. Ready? <sighs> yeah, that's always fun. <laughs> yeah. Sweet, the security's still down. Thanks to all my hard work. Huh? What do you mean by that? <laughs> Don't worry about it. Come on, let's keep going. Hey, 
I don't think I've ever seen those stairs there before. I'm actually kind of surprised there isn't some kind of uh, treasure in there. Okay, I don't think I there were any it. chests here either. Just gonna make sure there's nothing in here. I don't think there is. Okay. Show me your true form. Right away, the savage enemy, huh? Whoa, flow? Oh, that was the thing we got from uh, Maruki, huh? Yeah, that won't work. Um, you don't have any buff debuff. This is my other self. Let's go. Prepare yourself. Surprisingly tough. Persona! Eat this! Oh, nice. Persona! Okay, Tarunda, yes. Oh, he's weak to Frey, isn't he? Her skills won't work, so be careful. Yeah, and, and uh, On has the thing, so I have to be the one that hits him with it. Okay, I have to Tarun to him first. Damn, he recovered quick. All right, now we can use Frey on him. You're mine. We're all down. Was okay, job. he's a level 18, so we can't capture him yet. Maybe by the end of this dungeon he'll be there. Though. That'd be nice. He is a good persona to have on your side. I am thou. Die! Someone finish it. Oh, so does my physical attack technical this even if he blocks it normally? We're gonna find out. Yes, it does. Brilliant. Okay, that's good to know. Don't come back. Gotcha. Okay. Well, that's that. Yeah, I want that atom ring on Morgana. Give somebody else fray. I can see it. That brochure. Oh. Do you think that could be another pamphlet? Let's take it with us, Joker. Okay. Is this pamphlet different from the one we got before? You're right. It says it's the second out of two. Yes. Oh, and it has the rest of the map. Now we can use it to figure out where the treasure is, right? I suspect it's in the innermost point of this palace. If that's the case, the most suspicious spot seems like this main hall here. Oh yeah, those maps like are definitely different. Hmm. We will need to pass through the lounge and the gallery in order to reach it. The deeper in we go, the tighter security's going to be. We need to advance carefully, okay? Okay, if you say so. There's a treasure chest! Okay, revival bead, nice. Focus. Can't get through those yet. Ooh, that's one of the locked ones. We have four lock picks, I think. Okay, that looks like it's blocked as well. There's a shadow up ahead. The decision is your. Mm. Hmm. Okay. 
Yes. There's a shadow. A joker. Oh, this is gonna be fun. Feels like I might touch them accidentally. Let's be careful as we go through here, okay? You got it. All right, a chest. Where's that joker. guy gonna go? It's a treasure chest. Can he come through this? I almost want to like test it out just to see if they can walk through it. Oh dear. I'll reveal your true form. Now's our chance to strike. Less attacks will shut it down. Boothu and light, huh? So, something that I want to show you guys is that uh, as we start to get more Ma skills, like Ma Bufu, you want to be wary of the SP costs. So here we have two that are weak to Ma Bufu, right? So, if I were to take both of them down, it would cost me 8 SP to use a regular Bufu. But, had there been a third one, Ma Bufu would have ended up being the cheaper of the two. So, keep that in mind as you're moving forward and as you're running into new enemies. Okay, that can be pretty important to managing your SP. Also, I need to look and see what that SP item is actually giving me how much SP. I think three is a seven. Okay. Hmm. Child's play. I have something. I'll reveal your truth. All right, we made it. <laughs> Just wanted to take him down before we did anything else. Probably fire for you, yeah? Don't bother with ice attacks. Come! Kushi Mitama! Go down! Cool! Looking cool, Joker! Ravage them! Cool! Looking cool, Joker! Okay, guys. Let's do it! All right, level now, 16. Is through me. Nice. All right. Easier than cleaning my brushes. Okay. I don't think we have a way in there yet. So there's got to be some way to change where these are, where these lasers are. Okay, nothing down here, so this is the only path we have forward at the moment. He's just kind of chilling there, that means he's probably Treasure just a mid-boss. Well, not properly a mid-boss, but... But a fight they want us to do, for sure. Hey, there's a strong looking one over there. We've seen that kind before. His stance conveys the notion that he is no ordinary foe. I think the control room's behind him. He's probably guarding it to make sure nobody gets too close. However, we'll need to disarm the security if we want to ensure we have a safe infiltration route. Forcing our way through seems to be our only option. Our health's looking okay. Let's do it. Hey, are you ready to do this? I'm ready. Let's go. <laughs> Who are you? How did you get in here? It was simple. Well, that won't be the case here. Yeah, we'll see. Got Copa Tengu. Or wait, no, they're different. Uh, the ones on the side of the Copas. I don't remember your name. Monk of the Valley. Are you weak to gunshot? I don't think so. They use gun uh, attacks, but I don't think they're weak to it. Should have checked. I might actually know. Fufu. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> that went well. <laughs> oh, I don't like that at all. Persona. 
You have a pretty good shotgun right now. Okay, we need to, uh, Torunda. You know what? I can Bufu and then Tarunda. Gathering the power of wind. I do not like the sound of that. Let's go. Go in more. Okay, increases evasion. Let's just attack. Okay, we don't know weakness for you yet. If you have one, which you might not. Still my biggest uh, magic attacker. Kushi Mitama. Okay, I see you. Dude's on fire. Okay, so that's a high critical attack. We can see if we can get it on both. <laughs> So good. It's almost scary how good I am. Okay, guys. I love Lucky Punch. It doesn't do a lot of damage, but those high crit chances are great. I am thou. Have we tried Bufu? I don't see a weakness. Take this. Persona. Get wrecked. Hey, a Medea card. Whew, that guy was tough. I guess that's just par for the course in a palace. It really was on a totally different level from the other enemies, though. Hmm, he dropped some sort of card. A skill card is a special type of item used to teach one of your personas a particular skill. These cards can only be used on personas Analog currently has in his stock. The card will be consumed upon use, so employ them wisely. Save them for now. What's this for? I've never seen anything like it. Ain't it just some kind of loot? Come on, let's get back to exploring. Later, you'll get the ability to duplicate cards, so, uh... There's yeah, a treasure chest. save them. Oh! Got four lockpicks. Nice, that looks like a weapon for our oh. boy. Okay. I do want to check the stats just in case it is a low hit. Nope, looks like it's pretty good. 96 accuracy, 102 attack. I'll take it. Now, um, let's check the other side for any items. That's exactly why. Indeed. It appears this is the control room for the security. Sweet, let's turn that shit off already. I'm with you. Let's do it. Please input the password. Oh, uh, Another one? We'll just have to look for someone else who might know it. I hear the intruders already got past the central garden security. Yeah, I just got a call earlier to change the password here, too. What to? Better not be simple. Well, I was having some trouble coming up with a good one. For now, I set it to the numbers for Lord Matarame's feet. Lord Matarame's feet? What are you talking about? Let's get back on duty. There's a chance the intruders are nearby. Hmm. Matarame's feet? The hell is that supposed to be? Maybe his shoe size? Yo, Fox, you, you know that bastard's shoe size? I don't know. Unfortunately, I have never heard him mention it. 
Are we sure that is the proper password? Monorami's feet, what do you think that could mean? Well, we're gonna find out, aren't we? Show me your true form! Ooh, another one of those guys, huh? Ooh. Ooh, yeah. Alright. Well, we're gonna hit this guy for sure. So boo -foo. Curse skills won't work, so be careful. Curse skills won't work, so be careful. Haven't tried Garu on you. Persona! Going on, strike! Well, the Dawn pass to our guy because uh, he can regain SP. Yep, he gets seven. So good. Lot of damage. Hot damn. I'm glad we're getting tin right. clasps so we can make more uh, lock Child's picks. Play. Hey, what size you feet? There's something written here. Here we praise our most holy lord, I Ichiriusai Madarame the one ray of hope in this depraved world. He stands alone as his two adept hands paint into the future. None shall ever match his excellence. <laughs> He's really puffing his chest out here, ain't he? Hold on a moment. Could this be the spot of Madarame's feet that the security guard mentioned? It's at his feet. Oh, right. But isn't the password supposed to be a number of some kind? Hmm. I do believe there are numbers here, though. One, Ray of Hope stands alone with two adept hands. None shall match him. That means, so one, one, two, one. Oh, none is zero. So one, one, two, zero. Nice. Yeah, that must be it. Sweet, let's head back and shut down the security. All right then. We're gonna kill this guy though. I'll reveal your true form. He deserves it. I could catch another Jack Frost, or we could try and catch, uh, uh, what is, what is his name? Makami? Something like that. I don't see a weak Don't know what you're weak to. Well, there it is. You have fire. You put it over the baton pass. You're mine. Ooh, Let's strong. see if we can get Mikami. Lend me your power. Then let's talk. Once me understand you, me lend you my power. Poor thing, it looks scared to death. Me not understand. How did human outsmart me? Me not understand in what way you superior to me. So he's timid. And um so we just want to make him feel good? So cuteness, maybe? <laughs> maybe if you use human standards. Me not know. All humans look same to me, so do all beasts. Rude. <laughs> Since ancient times, humans feared and respected gods and spirits. So why me in this situation right now? Why me at your mercy? Times have changed? Me a bit envious of how you can be so calm and flexible. Me remember talking to you before, hmm? Me remember now. Me am not a shadow that belongs here. Me exists in the sea of souls of humans. Me am Inugami. That's what it was. Uh, my power is your power. Use it how you want. That's a new one, isn't it? Okay. All right, let's try that password we found. Password accepted. Disengaging security protocol. 
Yay! Oh, that opened all sorts of stuff. We'll definitely be able to go to more places now. Come on, let's get moving. Gotta get those chests. So this is our way forward, right across there. But we need to go here first. Oh! Bead chain, nice. That's the party heal all, isn't it? I think so. Dizzy vial, okay. I think we're ready to go. I don't think there's anything above us. <gasps> oh. Oh my. This is amazing. What a giant painting. Indeed, it bears such a bizarre texture as well. It's as though I could simply slip inside. What the? You okay? M um. My hand, it actually entered the painting. So we can go inside of it? Well, I don't see any other path for us to take. Let's give it a try. Oh, this is the intended path? Focus. Looks like it. Okay. They're giving us the uh, paintings early in this one. Dare you trample on my tranquil bamboo garden with those grimy feet. You shall not leave alive. What the heck was that? We're probably just hearing Matarame's thoughts. There's no need to panic. <clears throat> Matarame. Well, hold up. Oh. We're in another painting. Hmm, so this space is not merely one, but a multitude of paintings. Hmm. You're telling me they're all connected? Which one goes where? That, we will have to continue walking to find out. Joker! Can't you spot the connections with your skills? Suppose we can. Let's go back. I'm guessing that it's just leading us out. Yeah? Yeah, okay. But we had to check and see if I could walk left. I can feel it. <laughs> you know? How foolish. So he dares call us thieves who dirty his heart. The one who has sullied the very nature of art itself has no right to accuse us of such things. Save your emotions for later, we have to keep moving. Hey. I should Don't go known. staring at my butt. What are you talking about? <laughs> Oh, Ryuji. Hmm. Okay, no way to turn it off immediately, apparent. Okay, there's a dude walking around in here. Okay, he's moving the other direction. Okay, Ooh, cool. We have a... Sensation. a... I think there's a safe room. Show me your true form! Got it. Let's go. Going on strike. Oh, nice one, Fox. Get the Another baton pass. Persona. Ravage them. Looking cool, Joker. Finish him. Dead. Okay. Hmm. It's somewhere. Child's play. Okay, that opens that door. Shouldn't be anything uh, over here. Yep, just our shortcut. And a safe room. Ah, no. I expect this would be a great place from which to resume our infiltration. You are not wrong, Yusuke. How could this be? So many apprentices were caught up in this travesty, but I will be the one to end it. 
So all these paintings were actually done by Matarami's apprentices? And he still calls himself an artist? Yeah. Huh, the security system was no match for us. Okay, there's still three skulls and we know where one of them is. Do you need something? You'd like to read the registration? You'd like to register this? Register all of them. Time for some. Let's execute it. What path do you want? You can make a high pixie. I see. A strong persona indeed. Those are like two of my best ones right now. You okay with this? Nah, he's too weak. Still not a lot I can do right now that I like. Okay, Are you we finished? wait. What? It is time, inmate. We're here. What? Let's do it. Okay, this seems like a pretty good place to stop, actually, looking at my clock. So, uh, thank you all for being here. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you all next time. We'll continue on in this dungeon. Have a good one.